Hello everybody, oh my god, we start with a blitz. Welcome to season 46 playoffs between Ungern and his humans and Gdynik and his incredible necro team. In the booth with me is Flicky Flack, hello. Okay, Flicky Flack's distracted by Storybook Brawl, but we've started with a blitz and a broken neck, instant Kaz, so unbelievable start for Gdynik there. He's got incredible flesh golems, blodge guard. He's got Blodge Guard White, he's got Nudge 4 Guard White, he's got, you know, the, the Wolves are nice but they're not started. Um, he's got a Wrestle Ghoul which is fine, isn't it? A Block Shohan's Ghoul, so it's like, it's pretty min-max, it's like nearly 2k and it's like kind of pretty min-max. It's just absolutely incredible TV efficient team. Um, and what a start, what, an, what a start that is. Um, he has a bit of TV up, Ungern has a Wizard. And a bit. And I quite like this fireball here. Just starts off with a fireball. He's lost the ball and pretty much lost all chances. So maybe just fire back. He's got a very unexciting team. He's got a tackle pommer. Um, and one other mighty blow. And that's about all he's got. It's like, it's a pretty terrible team, isn't it? Like, guard tackle. Guard stand firm. Blood step attack. Like, you know, there's just not a lot to this team, is there? Yes, Lemon, yeah, it's a pretty it's a pretty great team for Gdanek. Pretty great team. And it's Gdanek as well, so <laughs> Okay. <Here's Pom. clears throat> Hello, Flicky. Hello, sorry. Did did you hear me earlier? Did you did you hear me? No. Then? No. no. Okay. I said hello yeah, and you just didn't respond. <laughs> no uh, problem. I, I said hello straight away and then when people started saying I wasn't on point, I thought <laughs> I'd maybe missed a, an in-joke or something and you'd called me something else or made fun of me in some way. Oh, no. no I think just... my mic just cut out. I don't know why. I'm just loading up the client now. Well, I'll take the opportunity to say hello as well, Mr. Deja Vu. I feel like we've been here before, Jim. Oh, glorious. Hello, Calcium. Oh, my God. Look at that. Look at that foul. Kills oh, wow. in all region. Just as calcium arrived. Did not expect that. <laughs> how you doing, Flicky? Yes. Hello, mate. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. Oh, how are the chops? I figured I owed it to you, Jim, to actually um, complete this replay. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, dear. Doctor feels bad. There's no plot in Fury Road. We've 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 gone over this. <laughs> okay, there is no plot. <laughs> it's just a music video that lasts for two hours instead of three minutes, and it's not as good as the Reckless Rick music video either. Um, yeah, thank you, thank you, Calcium, for for returning. Yeah, this I tried to do this last night and and my stream crashed and I got annoyed, so stopped streaming. Um, so yeah, we have seen a bit of this before, but. Not much. No. And to be fair, Jim, I have enough trouble remembering my kids' names and what I had for breakfast, so I really can't remember what happened in the game of Blood Bowl I watched last <laughs> night. <laughs> it will all be half a game. Oof, tackle pom. I mean, to be fair, he's got a decent amount of tackle, hasn't he? Like, that's the one thing that he's got. He actually does have tackle on, like, three of the blitzers. And he's got it on the catcher as well. So, like, this kind of heavily blodged team is is maybe not so good but there you go there's just a just a what's it called uh what's what's a full pow instant full glorious power. no i won't so give foul. in Uncan does a lot like of victorious. things wrong right he's pretty well pretty defend. insane but I he does defend. hit hard yeah 44 months of gym and one month gym enjoying blood bow glorious Glorious. Is that what uh, is that what's required in this one? Does he need to get removals? Does he need to do damage? Yes, I think so. I think his team is shit compared to Gdynix, <laughs> which is not really Fair. a slight on him, is it, as a person? But I just think, you know, obviously, his team is just nowhere near as good as his. So, yeah, I think that's fair, trying to high roll by doing that kind of foul. Milkman of Death, thank you very much for staying fantastic for 44 glorious months. And, yeah, there has been about one month in that time, yeah. Yeah, that's true. That's true. It's been a long time since I enjoyed Blood Bowl. <laughs> and <laughs> there you go. Now, I don't think Nick needed to do this foul, but 
I can understand why, like, you know, he felt the game was slipping away from him a bit, the drive slipping away from him a bit, so... Yeah. I think know. I said last night, Jim, I think I said last night that um, I wasn't a fan of that foul, but also, you know, being men down and fouling is really high risk. But, yeah. you know, after that blitz, which was probably as textbook a blitz as you want to see, it's sort of slipping away from him a little bit, isn't it? Yeah, it is a little bit. Oof. And this guy is quite good, isn't he? To be fair, this string three blood stepper is like really good to tie up tie up walls, isn't he? Yeah, that's a really good move there as well, because the werewolf um, runs the risk of getting frenzy trapped on the sideline. Although he does have sidestep himself, so I guess that's not the end of the world. But yeah, necros are running out of men's. Yeah, they are. They're getting banged on a little bit. <clears throat> Yeah, there's no, there's no. I mean, it, it's quite good having it on the ogre, right? He's strength five, isn't it? There's no, there's. It's turn three. There's no need to try and get rid of it. I think this is quite good. He could be a bit lax in ball protection, like the wolves are fast. If he gives it to somebody else, uh, that's a ridiculous. That's a ridiculous turn. All those removals, Blit, blitz him with the ball carrier ogre. What can possibly go wrong with that there? And another death. Boom. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now that turn. With <laughs> with uh, three removals, as now suddenly Gadenik doesn't have much of a team left at all, does he? Yeah, there's hardly any necro. Six down to six. He got one of his own sent off, and then three removed on the next turn. So he, he had ten, and then he's just down to six <laughs> in one turn. Ouch. That is a swing and a half, isn't it? <laughs> yep. But two very nice flesh golems right in the mix. And they are a huge pain in the arse for those flesh columns. Both Blodge Guard as well. Yeah, they're incredible. Yeah. But there is, he there have is a knack, no lack doesn't of he? Team. Building incredible teams. Yeah, well, I mean, that's the thing, isn't it? Like, you know, Nick is good at Blood Balls and he's good at protecting his better players and everything. Uh, you know, there is an element of that, but obviously there is just an element of luck as well. But still, good players will tend to do that better than bad players. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Sort of doesn't explain off Ungern, though, does it? <laughs> <laughs> Ungern, I was just actually thinking to myself while you guys were chatting there, I was thinking Ungern's like that journeyman in a, blood, um, in a, in a boxing event that really hasn't read the script. <laughs> <laughs> and then oh, yeah. absolutely overperforms. Kills a guy. But regen, that's two regen on deaths, but one failed regen on death. But like he's yeah. only he's going for the kills. <laughs> he's what you've got to do. We've all heard the strat. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I'm going sixty-eight percent. He is. I. He is a sixty-eight percent coach that I've literally never seen play well. <laughs> <laughs> so that's that's something, isn't it? <laughs> I, I played him earlier today, funnily enough. He's running humans in the current season, and uh, we caused two deaths each. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and that that's, was that's the rookie team you love. <laughs> he maybe should have gone for the ball there, Nick, I think. Like, this was a, like, yeah. a decent shot, right? Run, run one wolf down and then blitz with the other one. And yeah. if it works, I guess he would sidestep like to here. Um, but you, yeah. you, know, you could still get a lucky st scatter and you could have like something. Like. I didn't hate it. It's better than just giving up. Maybe. Maybe not. But. I hated him not going for this. And this is the point where we reached last night, Jim. Um, mm. And I actually made that comment. Yeah, he could have got He could have got the two wolves around to give himself, give himself a 2D with tackle. Uh, I, yeah, I, I, I feel that's a mistake. But we don't know what's going on in G'day Nick's head right now. You know, um, this would, this kind of attrition, this kind of damage would test any blood bowler, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah, I think, you know, maybe he just decided to give up and try to protect things as much as he could. Ungern, however, insta reroll. <laughs> no, yeah, I think, that's fair. I think that's fair, right? Yeah. He's, he's yeah. so many men up. All he can do now is go for attrition. Surely there's no threat from the uh, from the Necro with, with five players left. <laughs> is that ball, is that safe? That's... Yeah, there's guard. Yeah, around. yeah, he's got guard around it, hasn't he? And he's strength three. Yeah. So yeah, he's just trying to snipe something, isn't he? Doing it. Second half and overtime. Yeah. 
think Mizzy should have run away for a bit. Yeah, I mean, he's got a huge bench, so he shouldn't be too worried about the second half and, like you say, overtime. Sacrificing the lesser wolf. Yeah. For the glory, for the glory of the empire. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, bog standard second wolf, isn't it? All normals, nothing exciting, but still an excellent player. But yeah, that that's the thing. That's why I, I'm not that big a fan of the recycling wolves school because at the end of the day, if those four normals. He's a really good player, isn't he? Yeah, he is, he's a superstar on many many teams. Mm. Oh well. Not anymore, he's not, he's just got cast. <laughs> he did, another regen though. That's a couple of big regens. Yeah, regen saves him from the glue factory. <laughs> what did we lose, which uh, we lost the, the Adji White. Well, this is a, a possible 1D on the ball, isn't it? Yep. Maybe he could have even tried two. He could have tried dodging away that fleshy. With dodge, I yeah. don't hate it. Oh, no, he's on tackle. They're, he's on, they're both on tackle, so. Yeah, and just one reroll. Yeah, in that case, I did hate it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Has he got yeah. one turn chances? There's a stand firm and a side step. Yeah, there's two stand firm. Two um, stand back. Yeah, so oh no, no, he's killed. What one's killed? So yeah, at the moment there's one stand firm and a side step. I don't think you'll risk that side step. Oh, there's another side step. There's two side step. Is there a side step on the bench as well? Yeah, yeah, yeah he got, he got it. This is brutal. Yeah. And another greed in there. Yeah, badly help. <laughs> As you can see. This, this is standard ungun, this is. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Ah, he uses the wrestle to get him off. Love to see it. Love to see a wrestle man getting someone off. <laughs> Wait. No. Yeah, I don't think we'll see a one turn. Maybe though. I don't think you need to put the side steps on the LOS. There's there's no edge there's no edge for Oh he is putting the LOS. I, I don't agree with this. I would just put dross on the LOS. See, I don't think it's worth Yeah, it's surely players. Surely backlining is just good here, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's uh, like you know. I know Nick's good and everything. He's got a sidestep, isn't that? But I would just, I would just back him. Um, if he gets the pushes, fair play to him. Yeah. Like he's got claw for your, he's got claw for your uh, ogre. He's got tackle frenzy for the others. He might even just mighty blow tackle the uh, catch. Yeah, yeah, I think he's he's setting up for the uh, golem hit on the ogre and then the foul. I think. Yeah, I'd like to see the foul here. You can get a couple of zombies round and make that a three into three frenzy. If the ogre's down. I think at this time I'd like to go on record as to saying I really like Fury Road. I think it's an amazing film. <laughs> Do you? Yeah, I absolutely love it. You are right. It's thin on plot, okay? But it, just, the, just the spectacle of it. Um, and I, my, my biggest gripe is really a Morton Joe being quite possibly one of the worst villains ever. He's just useless, <laughs> isn't he? You know, he's a waste of space. Other than that, I absolutely love the film. Hmm. I didn't like the spectacle because everything was brown. Like orangey. I don't know, maybe it's orange rather than brown. Yeah, see, I, yeah, I, I, I dug that. I dug that. Mm. Although I have just got reading glasses, Jim, so maybe that explains <laughs> a lot. <laughs> <laughs> like, who are we fouling? <laughs> Catch, fair enough. The catch is annoying for the wolves to deal with. I, I quite yeah, like Yeah. 
yeah, I like that foul. Um, didn't pay off, but that was the right foul. Ogres don't score touchdowns today, so. Orcs with a K, I hate. I hate 40 K Orcs. That's really good. I don't want to hate the Warhammer Orcs as much, but I proper hate Orcs with a K. Is this why do we hate orcs with a K? I just I just don't like them. Oh, just like as a as an army in 40k. Yeah, generally don't like people that play them either. <laughs> yeah, I mean that was the very first army I ever started with, and I didn't like myself either. <laughs> you know, to be fair, well, as a species, they suck, don't they? Their fluff is crap. You know, they're almost as bad as space mummies. You know, um, they're just as bad. <laughs> friggin necrons the thing oh, is if people God. play necrons right if people play necrons it probably just means they're beardy and want to win games of 40k but the people who play orcs are like scream why at you and stuff and like <laughs> yeah. oh they, god they embrace yeah. it they embrace it that's oh, it god that was that's one it. of the worst things army. about games workshop back in the day was having to like join in and shout stuff and like they wouldn't yeah. they wouldn't let you use a special skill if you didn't shout something or yeah they wouldn't let I, I, the one tournament of, of of Blood Bowl that I didn't win in a Games Workshop was because they had they made me shout Blitz to Blitz and I didn't do it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I, re I refused to howl when I was Space Wolves and I wanted to use Ragnar's like special <laughs> howl ability. I was like, no, nah, I'm, I'm just not. I can't do it. Uh, I'm very sorry, Mr. Fantastic, but we're going to have to call it a legal procedure because your miniatures aren't painted using free colours. <laughs> Yeah, fantasy org players, they're not as bad though, no, they're not as bad as the 40k ones. The 40k ones are all like daka 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 and all that bullshit. <laughs> I would never, I would never like ever say daka. <laughs> no, never. You would never do daka, say daka, meet daka. Exactly. No. Why didn't he follow that? Oh, because he's going to, he's going to claw him. Okay. Yes, but yeah, I don't like Space Wolves players. <laughs> <laughs> Space Wolves, are, except Space Wolves are overpowered as fuck as well. Unlike unlike Norse, like Space Wolves are historically overpowered because because you know someone at Games Workshop has a boner for Space Wolves. I was just starting out when I played 40k. I dropped 40k quite quick and moved on to Warhammer, which I found a much better game. Do Space Wolves have thumbs? Yes. <laughs> yeah, I didn't really like that far. Oh, is it is it Gav, is it, that likes them? They they were like they were overpowered from through many editions for a long a long time. Gav Thorpe, isn't it? Wasn't it? Hmm? Yeah, they were they were like they were really overpowered for many editions of 40k. <coughs> I mean, I definitely hate simians more because they're not real. Yes, Sea Shark, almost certainly. Almost yeah. certainly. I haven't read any any Space Wolf fan fiction, but they've got like the most fan fiction, and the most fiction in general. Like they just they just like, like someone someone at Games Workshop now likes like Nurgle a lot more because Nurgle have had so much love oh. from Games Workshop. Oh wow, huge. Absolutely huge. The claw mighty does nothing. The rookie punch <laughs> devastates. <laughs> Ouch. That's... Oh, failed regen. That is massive. Yep, that's huge. There are no dice in Blood Bowl, though. Just remember that every time you get absolutely fucked by the dice. <laughs> you can be safe in the knowledge that there are no dice because Dio <laughs> likes to saying that. <laughs> I'm going asserting dominance with the most average team in the whole of Blood Bowl. Yeah, it's a really unexciting human team as well, isn't it? Like, wow. Wow, it's I like... It's hard to make an exciting human team, to be fair. They are just so <laughs> vanilla. You can make one more exciting than this, though. Like, it would be more exciting if it had less, so at least it could have Griff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, <laughs> Griffin a wizard would make this a bit more interesting, and yet somehow he's getting the job done. Oh, classic! Yeah, wolf dodge. Love to see a wolf dodge. Hey. 
<laughs> yeah, well, Dev, that's fair enough. Does it have a bunch of startups? It's got A plus strength. And it's got a guard lineman. I wouldn't say uh, that's a bunch. <laughs> no, tackle bomber. Um, yeah. But for another... startups and doubles, it's got a double and yeah, a startup. Yeah. yeah. But it could have a bunch of startups and it could have a bunch of doubles. Like, you it's know, you could a... have a move 10 edge 4 catcher, couldn't you? Like, you know, yeah. like, that's possible. That would be an exciting human team. <laughs> a, move, a move 10 edge 4 sprint sure feet. Oh, catcher removals. Would be good. I'm going to stop it. Ooh. Honestly. Um, it's it's a decent, functional human team, isn't it? It's... Yeah, where's the you other know, one? Oh, he's one. prone. That's a blitzer, isn't it? That's a blitzer. Yeah. That's a blitzer, that's a blitzer, that, that's a blitzer, and then that's one lineman with guard. It's like the Bosch of uh, Blood Bowl teams. Unexciting yet reliable. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, it looks like Nick will get a touchdown, but I don't think he's going to be able to stall it very long or very well. No, the the stall looks really tough from here, doesn't it? Those humans, pretty quick. Yep. You oh, that werewolf. Look, that werewolf looks vulnerable as well. Doesn't it? Yeah, he'll be getting he'll be getting pawned if possible. Yeah. Yep. It's very possible. <laughs> it's the definitely pile on. Given Ungun's uh, attrition dice to date, I'd say it's inevitable. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's going pretty well, isn't it? Instant didn't even Didn't even think about the re-roll. You know, <laughs> equity is not an issue in Ungun's universe. No. Wow. I think I think didn't he maybe enough. should have not re-rolled that one. <laughs> yeah. That that now that was a bad re-roll. Yeah, there was nothing good about that re-roll. Um, especially when he actually had, um, oh, he didn't, sorry, he didn't have a secondary hit, but he had that werewolf locked up. Yeah, terrible mm. reroll. Not a fan. <laughs> the unenthusiastic hand job of Blood Bowl team. <laughs> 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 Holy shit, that's never a truer word spoken. <laughs> oh dear. Well there you go, it doesn't he doesn't he doesn't I don't know how long he, he you know this is replays so we don't know how long he thought about trying to stall there, but does not go for the stall. It was hard when he was on diving tackle and stuff. <laughs> Johnny five. I I actually watched that chess clip. Um, I wish I knew what was happening in a game of chess. I'm sure it's very funny. Um, <laughs> yeah, the reactions were hilarious, weren't they? Yeah. That's all I could judge it on. Yeah. So, yeah, still got the full 11, but obviously the quality is significantly, significantly down with the uh, fleshy and the white gone. Flesh column is huge for a short stall. Yeah. Interesting that Nick is still stall. playing with this defense with about five turns to go. It's a bit it's a bit of a weird one, isn't it, the old Gadanic defense? It's kind yeah. of made this his own. It is. It's an interesting one. It's one that I would use with like wood elves or something. Yeah. yeah, I like it for Wood Elves and High Elves, but uh, I think it's... Oof, another cast. <laughs> it might be, is it? Uh, is it an Air Dev uh, setup? I know he's really into his uh, his setups and, and he's a big Necro coach as well. He, he might have got it from him. He's in chat. He might be able to confirm. I don't the, the, the Maybe he's not with Necros, but maybe he's a different one. Air, Air Dev's Necro setup he has. A guy over there and then like a block of six is what a dev does for necros but uh, it could oh, okay. be a, it could be an a dev or a dio setup i think it's gadenix though i certainly call it the gadenix setup um and i asked him about it and he said he was liking it but i 
he didn't he didn't deny he'd created it but I didn't know if I uh, I don't know if I you know said did you make this but certainly I, I said this is an interesting defense and he's like yeah I've been using it a lot I like it and stuff but I don't know if he if he made it or not well if we know one thing about Blood Bowl is that you don't have to have invented something to take full <laughs> credit for it yeah Do you know who made it here, Dev? Do you know who thought of this defense? I mean, he started with it the way, Dev. He started with it at the start of the game, and he just likes it. I invented it just now. Yeah, it's mine. It's a good point. I used it on my uh, on my wood elf run, so yeah, I invented it. Easy. <laughs> hey, Dev, on okay, which replay so, uh... did you see the setup first? Here we go. Mass basing from. I was going to say this is a bit herb derpy, isn't it? It is. It certainly is. And he's only one man up. There's like no reason to think he'll continue to be as lucky as he has been so far. This is pretty rowdy. He's probably about to go two up though, because he's going to take yet another hit. No, no, just push. <laughs> Refuses the hit with the uh, claw mighty. Ah, because he knew the dubs. He knew the quad skulls were coming. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. No. Oh. Quads. That's ridiculous. Brutal stuff. Ridiculous. Yeah, in a game where you're already behind, already struggling, when they come up, <laughs> it just hurts so much. <laughs> this this is why this is why Ungern burst. <laughs> he knew it was happen. Speculative yeah. speculative non tackle hit. Pow stuns. <laughs> That's some ne this is some next level shit we're witnessing here, Jim. It's ridiculous, isn't it? That's game, isn't it? Well, he's still got to get through, but yeah, it's. He does. The stun, though, so even if it doesn't get through he quite yet, he's got a 3D over on this side, but the over mm. if he wants it as well. It's gone stupid. Okay, that might hold him up a little bit. <laughs> Oh, there we are. There's another armor break for consolation. <laughs> oh. uh, making armor eight look like snot leg armor right now. Yeah. And that that unlocks the ghoul hit. Wow, he re-rolls that. That oh, is. What is what is he oh. doing re-rolling that? <laughs> it's just terrible. Isn't <laughs> it? That is a very ungun play. <laughs> it is. It is. It is typical ungun. You know, it was never in doubt that he was going to re-roll that, but it doesn't make it good. <laughs> so, yeah, he's, and he's left, I mean, he left 1D on the ball there, didn't he? Yeah, yeah, kind of. It wasn't that easy to get 1D on the ball, to be fair. It was a couple of dodges, wasn't it? Yeah, he's, so. got, he's got diamond tackle on, on that. Catches. Oh, yeah, he's got diamond tackle. Okay, ignore me. This Hidden might skills still work the best when it, you don't uh, see them. Yeah, I mean it might have still been worth going for it because it's gonna, you know, he's gonna be able to get up down, down here, isn't he? This uh, yeah. looking pretty bad. Yeah, he can throw quite the protective uh, side screen up, can't he? Mm. That's gonna help. <laughs> <laughs> yep, <I> killed him. <laughs> Was there any doubt? Yeah. <laughs> Another region. He's had like three regions from death. He's had some yeah, good luck in the region. Player definitely helps. Such a lucky dog, Nick. Like, um, he's like Brad Pitt in Snatch, isn't he? So you you understand, right? You go down in the fourth, okay? Yeah, maybe that was the best play then to, to dodge through dive and tackle because now, now he has now he's got nothing zero, yeah. no chance. Oh, 
If I was good day, Nick, I'd actually go away thinking I'm much, I must bring a much better team to the Chalice next time. But clearly, this tooled up Necro squad were not equal to the task. <laughs> and they still regen loads of deaths as well. Can you imagine if you just had like a Chaos team? He would have, he'd have like three players left on the pitch right now. <laughs> it would just be devastated. He'd have run out of space in his, in his Chaos box. <laughs> Yeah, that's crazy, isn't it? Like four regions. <laughs> Instant. Yeah, so he's gone this way, so he still had a 1D with Wrestle. Round the back. Gets it, but doesn't get the power. Wasn't bad, was it? Five plus? Yeah, yeah it wasn't the worst. Yeah, and then just stick the wolf in and hope for the best. Wow. Easy. Off of blitz. What the? What the? Yeah. That's wrong, isn't it? I'm sure this is wrong. Yeah, that's a strange one. He should have taken the 3D with the Goga first, shouldn't yeah. he? And then he could have um, stopped the sidestep. Yeah, you would have oh. thought he would have done that, but... But, you know, casual 3-plus against tackle. Yeah! Yep. Both sides out of re-rolls. But it doesn't it. matter, because he makes it wild. Yeah, I mean, he could have freed up a player on the other side of the pitch, come over and done the block hit, uh, the wrestle hit first, and blitzed with his tackle bomber if, if he wanted to blitz the wolf first before the ogre. That was possible. Yeah, I didn't like, didn't like that, but he won, so there you go. It had to be the right decision. <laughs> yep. Nine cas <cars> sustained. <laughs> 22 armor breaks to eight. <laughs> Ouch. Nine cars. Against one casualty for the human 52 percent armor. Good lord. Unbelievable. Um... Yeah, that's fair, Ray Dev. That was unbelievable, wasn't it? There you go. Congratulations, Ungern. Commiserations, Gadenik. Thank you very much, Flicky Flack and Calcium, for coming on and doing the commentary. Absolutely glorious, guys. Very welcome. I'm going to leave you two to it. Uh, go get myself something for tea. So I will, um, I will catch you later. Glorious. Thank you. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.